Hernandez. That could help out her argument for being in the all-around. Yeah, she's not going to move ahead after this with Lori's vault. She's been averaging right around a 15 on this event. Same exact vault we saw from Gabby Douglas. Coach right there, Maggie Haney. She said, Lori is like my firstborn. I've had her since she was five years old. It's her first time being at this level as a coach. Allie well, Raisman gets a... Her fifth on, or first or second off. But I think she's wrong. I think it's already a done deal because of performances that she's had so far, and she's great here, which helps the U.S. tremendously. Got a bunch of her releases that she'll do in a row. Transition down to the low. She actually left one of them out. This is where she struggled night one. That was great. She didn't have enough swing out of it to do the release that she typically does. She takes that out. So here are those releases. She would have done one prior to this. She chose to take it out. This one's very nicely done. And she'll do it again, but she'll straddle her legs on it. So it's a different move and then grab on Transition to the low bar. That's called a pack salto. Right, herself to think she's in there right now? Yeah, I don't think so. <laughs> I mean, I, I think that she could have a rough routine, could fall off, and she's still going to go. But no way is she thinking that. First year senior. Struggled a little bit day one, but that was fabulous. This is a really good routine. As every single one of her teammates standing and watching and cheering her on. Just the dismount left and she's going to Rio. Been dreaming of this, of this her whole life. Look at this. <laughs> what a great way to end it. Every one of the gymnasts came running. That was tremendous. She took on the beam and won. Not many of the gymnasts were able to do that tonight.
said she was going to cry, and she is.